Hello everyone, welcome back. Today's video is especially exciting for me because I get to do something a little more creative and outrageous. It's that time of the year when Halloween is around the corner. So I wanted to recreate a look for you guys which is inspired by Pennywise from the film It. But I obviously have a little bit of a glamorous spin on it. To get a perfect canvas, I am priming her face. I'm using a foundation stick to do her base makeup. To prep her eyelids for all the makeup, I'm using an eyeshadow primer stick. I'm using a translucent loose powder to set her under eye makeup, the eyelids and her laugh lines. Now I'm filling her eyebrows and I'm trying to make them look as straight as possible. With a kajal pencil, I am creating a black base on her eyelids. I'm just smudging it out all over. I've taken this reddish brown shade as a transition color to blur out any harsh lines. I'm also packing on some black eyeshadow onto her eyelids to intensify the black color. With the same kajal pencil, I'm creating two triangles above her eyebrows. The tip of the triangle is in line with the pupils of her eyes. I'm filling the color into these triangles with the sugar gel eyeliner. I am creating two inverted triangles under her eyes and again making sure that the tips of the triangles are in line with the pupils of her eyes. With a kajal pencil, I am creating little dots on the tips of each triangle. I'm also creating a big dot on the tip of her nose. I've taken the sugar gel eyeliner on a fine liner brush and I am outlining her lips. I'm just trying to give it that curly clowny shape. I'm using a red lip color from Color Bar and filling in the lips. I'm also taking a brush to blend the black outline with the red to create a beautiful ombre. I'm applying some mascara from Faces Canada and I'm also adding some kajal to her waterline. I'm using a dramatic pair of false eyelashes from Glam Girls and I'm just applying some glue and placing it as close to her natural lash line as possible. So wasn't that really really simple? I didn't need a whole lot of products to do this. And you too can rock those Halloween parties with just simple products that you may already have. You just need a little bit of creativity. I hope that you've enjoyed today's video. If you do create some interesting looks for Halloween, please share them with us. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys!